beautiful Geminis, welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me here, Gemini. Thank you for your support, your generosity, all your likes, your comments, and your subscriptions. Thank you so much, everyone. Welcome to your new subscribers, and welcome back, everyone who has been so generous to me. I do appreciate it. Thank you. Let's go Gemini energy. Let's get some goddesses on here for Gemini. One more. Hmm. Gemini. 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 Ge Ooh. Yamoya. The goddess of all that flows. I am the ocean of creative energy. And I give birth to what exists within me. Lalita. Playfulness is a spiritual power. Laughter leads me back to light. Zhao Guan Ying, the mystic of peace. I am peace. When my mind is clear, the way is clear. The Black Madonna, Our Lady of Hermits. I transform pain and suffering into the greater capacity to love. So you've had a lot of um, pain and suffering here. Gemini, but it is transmuting your pain into blessings. There could have been a lot of confusion, but when your mind is clear, that's likely why you are the signs with the swords. You demand clarity. Truth and clarity. You've had a lot of burdens. Our Lady of Hermits. A lot of wisdom being gained through hardships and suffering. like seeking intentions of peace here cycles of the new beginning so someone's feeling like a victim Your optimism is what keeps you going. You've been able to transform your pain into peace. Your family, your friends, your guides being very important to you to help you through this transformation. Your attitude of gratitude and optimism is what gets you through things. Kindred partnerships can come in forms of family, friends, and guides, helping you to transform. Abundance of friendships, signs here. Hmm. Hmm. 
enchantment is here. Gemini. Oh my God. A lot of betrayal this Empress has had. Someone feels like Holy Jesus. Somebody is just acting like emotionally unavailable. It's like going on here This is a star seed. This is a healer. This is an empress who is blessed. Blessed with abundance. Blessed but they were betrayed. third party interference when I have the truth I have clarity somebody was cheating on an earth angel And now it's like this emperor is angry. Because they're stressed out. I don't know what's going on here. Somebody hiding that they were married. Or hiding that they were in a commitment. Or hiding that they were in a marriage deceiving someone about a marriage hiding someone is they could have been hiding a family Somebody was laughing or
somebody is in regret now choosing this other lover um they're in regret they're angry that they chose this other lover they're in a long term connection here This is the King of Wands who's regretting choosing another lover. You may have confronted someone, Gemini. You may have confronted someone or someone confronted them. Gemini, hmm. Somebody could have Gemini. This could be a fight between two masculines. A fight between a King of Wands and a King of Pentacles. You may be confronting both. You may be going and demanding the truth from this King of Wands, this King of Pentacles. There could be a physical altercation here, Gemini, between two masculines. The King of Wands seems to be the one that is angry. The King of Wands seems angry. They feel like they've been manipulated somehow. They were in a long-term relationship. This is somebody who is in a long-term relationship. This is an empress. Uh, they were in a committed relationship. It's like you want truth. You want clarity. You could be confronting a King of Wands and a King of Pentacles. Somebody here... You don't trust something, Gemini, or someone doesn't trust you. It's like you have to make a choice, a decision. So you might be like, you might be the type that gets a lot of attention. Gemini, you could. Oh, there's some friend here. You might be confronting this having a war, having a fight with the King of Wands or the King of Pentacles. They seem to be friends. They seem to be friends. Drinking bodies or something like that. You want the truth. You want the clarity on something. Is 
this is making a choice. Somebody is feeling overwhelmed. Somebody feels like somebody's been giving to two and causing a tower. Leaving this Empress single. of the hermits. This is someone who got ghosted. This is someone who's a wise sage. This is somebody who does not like confusion wants the truth, wants the clarity on a situation. <sighs> As transmuted their pain and suffering into joy and happiness, This is a addiction or this is an obsession. Somebody instinctively knows. This is an intuitive. This could be a tarot card reader. They're a hermit. They are a wise sage. They seek the truth. They seek knowledge. They seek wisdom. This is someone very wise. It's like, I want the truth. I demand the truth. I want to know the truth. There's a conflict here or someone Someone could have been Someone is very wise to have retreated. Look, this person is dealing with the devil. They're dealing with addictions. This person could have a sex addiction or an alcohol addiction or something like that. They're always seeking 
greener grass. They're always seeking greener grass. And it's like this person could have, like, always going partying or always has time for their friends and other people, but This addiction could be making them ill. This is an addiction that could be making this masculine ill. If it's drinking, they're drinking too much. like this person works, eats, drinks, sleeps, works, eat, drink, sleep, work, eat, drink, sleep. They seem to always be they don't like confrontation. They don't like being they don't like being confronted. They don't want to tell the truth. The problem with this person is they're always looking outside themselves for fulfillment. They don't go within. They always look external for fulfillment. Now, it's okay, you have a sense of humor, and you're smart, and you're wise, and you're beautiful, Gemini. But this person is always discontented. It's not you. It's this person. You have the ability to make this person smile. You have the ability to make this person laugh. You have this ability, but it's like their buddies are a priority. Or their friend groups or their family. They love attention. They like the opposite sex attention. And they're always looking. This is a wandering eye, a wandering heart, a wandering mind, a wandering soul. It's like they're. N if a person has not learned to go within and be content within, how can they love anything or anyone else? Because this person does not love themselves. They can say, I love you. They can promise you the moon. But they're never content. You can get sex from them. You might be able to get financial gain from being with them. But you'll never get their love because they don't love themselves. It's sad. This person likes being liked. They have low self-esteem and they like to be accepted. They like to fit in. They like to feel like they've got every friend and every place that they go to and it's like they're void emotionally now they can say I love you but they're missing something inside themselves Like, it shows that this person 
was in a long-term committed relationship with this empress. The high priestess is someone who uses their intuition and their knowledge. It's like, I want the truth. I want the truth. Just tell me the truth. But this person, I don't think, could tell the truth. If it hit them in the face, because I don't know if they know what the truth is. They have an addiction, and it could be to alcohol, and it could be to drugs, or it could be to sex, or all three. This person works hard, they're a worker, and they are a provider, but it's almost like they resent it. They resent the role that they're in. This is a discontent lost soul. They're not sure why they do what they do. They're not sure why they even commit. They're not sure why I don't even th this is like a lost soul. I mean They're always searching. They're always longing for something else. That's a discontented soul. So if the Empress cannot give this person this is an earth angel. This is somebody who's very patient, very tolerant, this is somebody who does things divinely. They're divinely guided. They're divinely... Um, they had an empress. They had an earth angel. And they're always searching, longing, longing for something more, 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 instead of being appreciative for what they already had. You know, my dad used to say, a bird in the hands were two in the bush. But not in this person's mind. They don't care about the bird that's in the hand. They want the two that's in the bush. You know what I mean? They're always searching for fulfillment and thinking that they can find fulfillment somewhere else. If they look long enough and hard enough, they'll find what they're searching for. But the truth is they'll never find it because it isn't out there. It's within. It isn't out there. The perfect person does not exist. So it's like they could have abandoned and ghosted this earth angel thinking that, you know, they were going to find the ultimate prize out there somewhere. But the truth is it doesn't exist um, because, you know, you meet somebody, it feels like the honeymoon stage where this is the perfect person for me. They're perfect. They're absolutely gorgeous. They're handsome, they're smart, they're intelligent, they make good money, they this, they that, they the other thing, but they're void inside their soul. This person has the potential to be a An emperor. They do have that potential. I'm going to be straight up. They have the potential to be an emperor.
but not this endless searching. Searching, if you're not content with an empress and an earth angel, you will not be contented with anyone. That's what this is saying, Gemini. This person secretly is angry, frustrated, actually resentful, but they hide it. They could be like a gentle giant. They have deep wounds. They do. They could have like anger issues toward their father. And quite honestly, that's why this person gravitates toward, you know, likes having family and friends around them, even if they're toxic ones. <laughs> They don't understand that, or they may understand. It's their childhood upbringing that's influencing their connections, their love connections. Now, they could have father issues. They could be really angry about certain things that their father said or did. Maybe, you know, they felt abandoned or rejected. It's like a part of themselves that is void, left void. But no person can fill that void but themselves. And it is doable, like it genuinely is. They hide their pain through self-medication, honestly. The first love you will ever have is the love with yourself. But they don't tell you that as a kid. You know what I'm saying? And it does affect how you view relationships. It seriously does. This is a person who would gain a lot of wisdom. They need a healing. They do. Hurt people hurt people, right? Not always, but quite often. What's behind that hurt is anger. You know, what's behind self-medication is heart. What's behind resentment and anger. It's all forms of hurt. It needs healed. That's why this earth angel was sent to this masculine in the first place. 
to let them see and expose to them the things that were hidden. <laughs> Not everybody likes that, though. Not everybody likes to have things pointed out to them, but this person was playing victim, and they're not a victim. They might have been a victim as a kid, but they are not a victim now. They're responsible for their actions. The void will never be filled until they learn to fill it for themselves and they learn to love themselves and accept themselves. Then they'll be free to love. And they may need professional help to do that. This person could have taken the honored path. They could have married someone. But they're lonely. They're on the decrease. You know, karmic lessons are hard for some people, especially some who are just hurting individuals. You know what I mean? You know, it takes a long time to come to terms with those issues. I got to say, we all have had experiences in our childhoods that are not so favorable, but it's being able to cope with them and understanding them is half the battle do you know what i mean like being able to understand why is half the battle this person is heavy their spirit is heavy I don't even think that this person maliciously tried to hurt you, Gemini, but hurt people hurt people, especially people that care about them. It's almost like a test. You know, they're going to leave me too. It's triggering abandonment issues and rejection issues and of course no one's gonna stick around or watch somebody self-sabotage their lives you know what I mean it's called tough love they need to address some issues and some codependency issues And it'll become much clearer. Take care.